Hey guys, how's it going? So unfortunately today, still pretty ripped up from the weekend, so no heavy lifting. And I mean, it was so hot out there today that it just like destroys your body. And uh, so yeah, my legs are still killed from the squats, but I was like, eh, you know, there's always like, one thing I like to do every week is still hit my calves. So the end of, the end of tonight, I can't really make a heavy lifting video for you guys. So I figured I'll just make a video, show you guys what I do for my calves. Strong on TV a little bit there. I'm watching this on a classic, so I'm watching this since I got home. It's like six hours long or something. So I'm not going to get it all in tonight. But anyway, my calves, I pretty much do, do uh, when I do these, I do 100 and not all the ones. I do five sets of 20. So sit back and enjoy the ride. for a few days. I didn't count that first one because it threw me off balance. Kind of technically 20. Up next in our men's heavyweights, Alex Kelly in lane three. <laughs> in lane two for our lightweight men, we have Josh Harrelson. You guys can't really see the TV. Not just in a little bit, but it's kind of like too far away for the camera. Yeah, she's getting late. So I'm just going to kind of get these in chill for a little bit and then it's time for bed. So uh, on Friday, for any of you guys that follow me on here, uh, Friday, go to that secret location for sure, unless it's like pouring down rain. I already go find some really heavy stuff to lift that day. My dogs are looking at me like, why is this guy always talking to his phone? <laughs> why is he talking to his phone? This is still so beat up. It's actually really, really, really hit the calves today. Man. So that's, um, these are 235, so that's 70 pounds altogether. Like I say, uh, five sets of 20, that's 100. That's normally what I do. And if you need to take it up from there, do 200 or whatever. It's kind of your own preference, but I find 100 of them. Once, twice a week, whatever you have time for. I do so many things, but like ideally it'd be perfect to do everything twice in a week, but I just do too many things to do that. So uh, try and get everything in at least once a week. Then, uh, try to uh, not only do that, but then I'm always trying to find just different things to keep the videos interesting for you guys too, different things to lift it. So let's uh, squeeze out number three. Tonight. My legs weren't already so killed that wouldn't hurt so bad. Man, oh man. I'm okay, dude. Okay. You got your cookie? You gonna say hi to everybody? Okay. 
you guys uh, I'll give you guys a tour around here some night. But when I do, when I'm on my bench and I'm doing my flies, it's like every time I sit up, Diggy will come running over and check on me. So I, I don't know if any of you guys have that, where like you exhaust yourself on your weight bench and your dog comes running over to check on you. But my dog does that. If your dog does that, let me know. Like. That's uh, like leave a comment or whatever. This will be a YouTube video. So, um, yeah, let me know. Does your dog come check on you when you're like, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Charlie doesn't. My female doesn't. She's like, yeah, whatever. You know? But Diggy's like, Dad, are you all right? <laughs> you come, now you hear me talking. Hey, Charlie, you gonna come say hi? <laughs> I'm fine, I'm just hurting from the weekend, eh? Hmm? Oh, I know, I know. I know. Oh, I know. Yeah. Yeah. Two more sets to do. My, uh, my poor chickens tonight were like still panting, so I left all their, like, their windows open. They've got like the mesh so nothing can get them. So before I go to bed, I'm gonna have to shut the one just so in case it rains, no rain, but I'm gonna leave a couple of them open for It's so hot, I want them to be able to breathe, the poor kids. Okay. Let's do uh, one more and then we got one left. It's a vibe. Just gonna say, hopefully that's actually recording. That would suck. I'm probably gonna do that one of these days too by accident. You can go out the doors open, Booze. Let me see. So you guys. The sunglasses, the headband, the traps, and the purple socks. It's quite a statement. I love it. stretched in there now, so it doesn't hurt, so kind of gave it a minute in between that one there. But uh, what do we have? So we're at like seven minutes, right? And I got one more set to do. So as you can see for anybody, this really is not hard. You don't have to start with 35 pound kettlebells. You can start with anything, like I got a couple of uh, 30 pound dumbbells even. If you're just starting out, you can do that. Anybody, you can start lighter, obviously. You can start heavier if you need to, if you're a great big giant of a person. Ten seconds. All right, you guys. We'll get that last one in. And I might as well face the camera this way so you can see what it looks like that way, I guess. But. Stick with 100 tonight. That's what I usually have been doing, and soon I'm gonna to want to take that up a bit. But uh, believe it or not, I'll feel that tomorrow on my calves. Just that 100, 100 hits on the old calves, 70 pounds. You'll feel it. No worries. Well, that's the thing. The farmers carry the squats, all that stuff. It's more upper legs, I find, right? So. To me, I still want to hit those caps. You know, this is just fun. It's a good way to do it. Um, and like this time of the year, obviously, I can go outside, do all this crazy stuff, give you guys all kinds of heavy lifts. In the winter time, when we're stuck in here a little more, this is the kind of stuff I'm gonna have to do more when I'm in the house. This time of day, if you're outside, you're gonna eat a lot of mosquitoes. So, you know. So it is. Uh, so what are we at, 100? You guys want to go to 150 tonight? What the hell, eh? Making a video, might as well. Let's 
still do, we'll do 140, and then there's 10 to 50, so maybe we'll just do 160, oh, right. do three more sets. What are we doing? these guys tonight and man some of the weight that these people can push even like some of the girls it's just crazy to me it's what they can do crazy the joy of being young well you know what i really like right here brian bain so busier. We're at 120. Mm -hmm. We're at 120. Do a few more. Even though the handles jumped up another 50 pounds each hands, he got some distance. Yep. There's a lot of guys in this weight category that did not do that. That's true. That one could be about four or five or eight or nine yards. That's a good difference. We got five more athletes in the men's heavyweight open. Up next out of Canada, Joey Lavallee. Chucking up his hands over there. And the lightweights are done. See, this is all heavyweights now. So, Joey, this is all you, dude. Joey putting on a solo show for us. But again, he is back with a Heavyweights. A veteran to the Shaw Classic. Yeah. A stunning performer from last year. Doing the old heavyweights on the TV now. I just finished up with the lightweights, so that's kind of where strong. I'd be. Very strong. Very strong. If I was Somewhere anywhere near those boys. If he can finish this event weekend being accurate and precise, he might be the 16th man. Oh, yeah. Strongest man on earth next year. Oh, yeah. I can see that. There's a couple other guys. You're going to be on video. Yeah. They're coming up next. Mm -hmm. Say hi. Oh, say hi. So, is that just the first set? I think that was 120. I actually just lost count, so we'll call that 120. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what it was. Distracted, play with my dog. There you go. Yeah, there he goes. Out to the races. Running with 700 pounds. Yeah. Man, it's heavier on the way back. Come on, good transition. Let's go. Turn on the gas. Go, Joey, go. Let's go. Awesome. <laughs> that was crazy. Okay, Boos, go lay down, okay? Good girl. Good girl, go lay down, okay? Let me finish up. That was fun. One more should be better be at least 160. Another veteran to the shot class. Yeah, I kind of like got talking there, really lost, made a lost count. That long press on event one. But following a 17 second run from Joey, the pressure is on. Cats up next to me to just open the door for her and then she doesn't come in. All right, you guys, we'll keep you waiting. One last set, we're at 14 minutes. Yeah. Oh. He's in his belt. 
For anybody that does that, the, the, the less time you give yourself in between, the more they're going to burn while you're doing them. So if it's hurting a lot, just give it a minute in between, right? Give it your 60, 90 seconds. You know, it's all good. 20 seconds left. Let's go. Oh, but he's got like three feet. He's got this. Oh. Love those guys. <laughs> Love you guys too. Anyways, I'll see you guys tomorrow night if I'm healed up enough. We'll do something big. Later, amigos. Have a good one.